Welcome to Somish channel. In this video, I am going to teach how to find HCF using log division method. For example, we can take find HCF of 48, 80 and 96. First, we have to choose any two numbers. So now I am going to choose 48 and 80. So first, we have to find HCF of 48 and 90. 80. So to find the HCF of 48 and 80, now we have to divide it. Now we have to find the largest number. Here the largest number is 80. So now we have to consider 80 as divided. Here the smallest number is 48. So now we have to consider 48 as divisor. So 48, ones are 48. So the remainder will be 32. So here the remainder is not equal to 0. So now we have to consider 32 as divisor. And the previous divisor as divided. Here the previous divisor is 48. So now we have to consider 48 as a new divided. So 32 ones are 32. So the remainder will be 16. Here the remainder is not equal to 0. So now we have to continue the process again. Now we have to consider the remainder as new divisor. And the previous divisor as new divided. So here the previous divisor is 32. So now we have to consider 32 as our new divided. So 16 twos are 32. So here our reminder is 0. Now we have to stop the process here because here the reminder is 0. So the last divisor will be the HCF. So the HCF of 48 and 80 is 16. So next we have to take the HCF of 48 and 80 and 96. Here the HCF of 48 and 80 is 16. So now we have to take 16 and 96. So now we have to find the HCF of 16 and 96. Here the largest number is 96. So now we have to consider 96 as the divided. Here the smallest number is 16. So now we have to consider 16 as divisor. So 16 6 are 96. So the remainder will be 0. So here the divisor is 16. So 16 will be the HCF. So the HCF of 48, 80 and 96 is 16. Hope you friends all understood how to find HCF using long division method. 
Okay friends, if you did not subscribe my channel, then please subscribe to Soms channel and press the bell button so you can receive all my updated videos regularly. Bye friends, thank you.